Hi Cancer, welcome to your weekly reading for June 8th, 2020. Please show me what Cancer needs to know, hear, or see. Thank you. Oops. I hope everyone's doing awesome today. And here is your first card. Ooh, nice. Five of Wands in the upright. Getting a reward after a lot of long hard work for a long time. Be winning an argument this is um, a struggle or a debate um, it's a competition card you got the job you got something something you've been fighting for for a long time you're getting it this week could be money in your how the four of swords in the reverse <clears throat> excuse me this is about saving money on your own, something you've worked towards on your own, saving up for something, buying something that you've wanted for a long time. You're getting it. This is something you've done on your own, something that you've planned for. Um, this could be something to give yourself a rest or something to make your life easier. Streamlining something. Something that takes the work out of something. In your why, you have the five of, uh, sorry, the five of coins in the upright. Definitely alone. Um, you might have felt like you were left alone or you might have removed yourself from some kind of argument or some kind of debate as well. Two fives. So you're trying to change something by yourself. You've definitely been um, thrifty. This is not spending very much money and it's in the how. You could have been left short. I feel like you could have been like this can this can literally be feeling left out in the cold by yourself. Left to struggle by yourself for quite a long time and you're you're winning it. You're overcoming it. You overcame some kind of struggle. This is the other woman card, so for some of you, um, this could involve, this could be, this is the why, so it could be because of a third party in a relationship and how you're going to feel. Nice. The nine of coins in the upright. <clears throat> Very accomplished. This is the consequences of your, your work. This is the consequences of something. You know what it looks like to me? It, it looks like there was a negative reason for you being put in some kind of struggle and left on your own to, to solve something. This took a lot of mental work as well, a lot of determination, but you are completely winning it. Um, but where was I going with that? Oh, that it was a negative reason, but boy, did you ever come out ahead. This is being self-sufficient. This is being very, very resourceful. Um, this is having enough. This kind of feels like the MacGyver card to me. This is um, someone who, they not only have enough, even when they don't, you know, when they're like here in this not having enough money, they know they can get it, they know they can make it, they know that they can manifest it. And like I said, this could have been because of a heartbreak, because of um, a third party relationship and it ended and left you in a very, very vulnerable position, but you overcame it. And boy, did you overcome it. This is, this is really being on top of the world but you're tired. You might be lacking some motivation right now. You might have been
kind of going all out and really um, like not getting enough rest. This is also when it's in the upright, it's it's a rest card and it's in the reverse. So you're tired. Um, the, this is the how though. You've kind of worked yourself too, too hard, but it's paid off. So it's, it's good, but now you're tired and there's some kind of, um, this is confusion. It's, um, it's like you're staying on top of your game. You're, this is being a, a fighting force for sure, but you're tired and you could be confused. What's your advice? The Queen of Cups in the upright. I feel like this is loving yourself. This is being alone. This is someone who is very forgiving, very spiritual, very loving, very soft. I feel like this is also about self-care. Um, this the advice in this card could mean that you need to like pamper yourself also down here this is being a very good friend to yourself you might need to take some time by yourself as well Let's see what the bottom of the deck is oh queen of swords in the reverse. Um, this could be this other woman. This is someone who is very difficult. She creates problems. This person could have been trying to cause confusion. To me, this looks like you are understanding. You're forgiving this person. You understand. This is someone, this is like, um, what's that saying? hurt people hurt people and you're looking at them like it's okay I understand like you you're very very forgiving of what somebody did to you this could be a friend this could be an ex this is someone who is someone who's been a they've been around the block a few times they've been hurt a lot um, the Queen of Swords is thought of as the Widow card or Divorcee, but upside down, it's someone who is very vindictive, very, um, like I said, hurt people, hurt people, and caused a lot of confusion. And like I said, could have been a third party in a situation that you were in, but you forgive this person. Um, this is also being a good friend. You could have felt manipulated by this person or this person might have walked away and you were confused and you might have even missed them you might have thought this person was a good friend or maybe they were a partner this feels like two women like a, a friend kind of situation it could have been a friend that was a third party in a in a romantic situation as well but you are standing alone and very very strong and very very soft you're not bitter at all i think you worked through a lot of stuff it was a long process a lot of internal debate a lot of internal struggle you might be cutting someone out as well someone out of your life but no hard feelings You're definitely overcoming something this week. You're climbing out of some kind of pit that somebody left you in. Standing very, very strong and very wise. This can also be you, um, this energy of, of breakup. This feels like someone that has broken up or been broken up with. For some of you, I feel like this is also your energy, cutting something out. This is um, also, when it's in the reverse, it's about a family. 
and about a family person and so you could be cutting that out you could be moving on from this energy of I feel like this is about a past relationship that um, like I said left you alone left you to struggle alone left you out in the cold alone and you persevered and are doing very very well to build yourself back up you could be leaving some kind of relationship memories in the past and moving on by yourself but I do feel like this is another person in your life that's related somehow um, to being an extra person in your life that caused a lot of confusion and caused some kind of chain of events that was very 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 hard for you to overcome but you did awesome reading all right cancer your shuffle song is called making gestures and it's by the pack ad all right i love you guys have a great week bye